Hey y'all, I'm James Farmer and I wanted to welcome y'all to my house, Farmdale, here in my hometown, Perry, Georgia, where I like to say it's just another day in paradise. Today we are planting up some beautiful planters from Ballard Designs. If you've got a sunny spot that you need a great focal point or a centerpiece, I love using a pedestal urn, in particular to plant it up with succulents. Succulents love the heat, they look fantastic for summertime, and they really make you look like a better gardener than you really are because their maintenance is so low. They show off so well in this pedestal urn right here. And so what I've done is I've started planting it because I'm gonna use it in a spot on my porch. I'll show you next. What I did first was I removed the drain plug. The drain plug is great because it can hold water if you need to hold some water for these containers for that use. But if not, if you're using it as a planter, good drainage is key. The next thing I did after removing the drain plug is I filled it with some gravel. That gravel helps the water to slowly drain out and it allows to, it to mix with the potting soil, which creates a wonderful environment for the roots, especially for these succulents. They like kind of a rocky terrain to grow in. So once I filled it with some good potting soil, and y'all, that's important to know too, I use really good rich potting soil that has great organic matter in it. This is actually composted manure, and it is great because it has all the great organic matter that plants need, gives them the fertilizer and the materials that they need, those nutrients they need to grow, and takes the work out of fertilizing for you. So I filled this up with the gravel and then the potting soil, and I've started planting the succulents here. I'm using the succulents mixed up. Some have blooms on them, some have different shoots, some look more like a little nest, but I love the lavenders and the greens and the jades and how they look so great with the neutral finish of this container. I'm gonna add this last one right here, removed it from the pot, worked the roots up a little bit, makes it easier to plant, stimulates the roots for their new growth, and then I'm gonna tuck it in here, plant it in, and when you're planting succulents, if a leaf or two breaks, that's not a problem because you can tuck it in the soil and it'll root. And then to finish it off, I like to use a combination of moss and then maybe even some rocks because they kind of have a good, a good balance of texture. So I've got some pea gravel here and I'm gonna use those, tuck in with some moss. And then the moss, it's just the icing on the cake. It's what makes it look beautiful but it also helps conserve moisture as well. Tuck the moss in here and add a couple more rocks. And y'all, this is a great way to have a centerpiece that lasts all summer long. Also, it looks fantastic in a container that looks great all year round. There we go. I've got a spot up on my porch where I think it'll get plenty of sunlight and look great all summer long. Let's go see how it looks. Thanks y'all for watching. You can see Ballard Designs collection of indoor and outdoor planters at ballarddesigns.com. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button to see more videos like this one on Ballard Designs YouTube channel.